I come from a yachting background. I got very inspired by seeing the Gen 2 car with Formula E. I went to a race having in mind that I wanted to merge racing, especially car racing, with something new in the marine sector. So I then started the designing and studying the design, trying to get away from the, the range anxiety that we have on land, electric cars. So the whole of the design was something I came up with, started to study. You said you came from a yachting background. You're now working on, as you say, cutting edge technology. Do you think that there is going to be an adaptation of the technology in the boat racing on leisure boats? It all started out of the commercial boats. So we took the sister of the race board. We took that commercial vessel, redesigned it a little bit for the, the racing environment. But then having in mind that all the development and technology into the race board, we're gonna use into the commercial market. It is so exciting. It is rock and roll, as you said. Yeah. But the entire series does go beyond that, doesn't it? There is this educational aspect. There's the sustainability aspect. How important was it for you to have that as part of what you were getting involved with. That was always uh, what triggered me to, to start this journey. We have a uh, summer house in Sweden, so I grew up by the water. So I went out with my dad to take out the boat. And then, you know, you see all the oil spill from the motor, and then you start. And we had so many issues and problems with that outboard motor. So. I always had this feeling that we need to improve this. So that was always the full, full inspiration for this project. So to see with the E1 Championship now, organizing events, having sustainability at the forefront, merging across uh, from sectors and to be together in this journey, to, to make the world a little better place, is very exciting. Talking of exciting, we've got the first D1 race in Jeddah. How excited are you about that? So excited. I was thinking yesterday, you're so heavily in this, right? So you kind of forget sometimes from where it started to where it is. I look at the race words as my babies. So this is the first time where I see my babies out to life. They're gonna perform and the uh, mama is just saying bye bye to them. But then seeing the, the amazing team owners dressing the babies as well with their with the liveries in, in different logos and colors. So this personality, right, comes. And then with the pilots and also seeing the different driving styles, it is a little different or difficult to drive. In the beginning, I was a little scared that it was gonna be too easy, but in fact, that's not the reality. So that's, uh, that's very exciting.